Well, despite the rainy weather, we have plenty of indoor activities for you to enjoy. And here to give us a few details, Jason Joyce from the Isthmus. Good morning to you, Good Jason. Good morning. Now, we have a lot of things going on inside, so yeah. let's start with the big one. Yeah, the Wisconsin Film Fest, of course, is, you know, sort of takes over the city. It's a little different this year. It lasts eight days, and it's taking place outside of downtown. It's at Sundance, mm -hmm. in addition to a lot of campus venues. Uh, I'll warn viewers, tickets are going fast. Okay. I mean, tickets for a lot of screenings are already gone. If you're interested in going, wifilmfest.org okay. is the place to go. You can find out what's sold out, what's not sold out. Tickets do remain, especially for the weeknight shows coming up, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. There's still a lot of shows for that. And if, honestly, if you want to duck out work a little early. We'll write you a note. Yeah, exactly. Okay. There's there's a, uh, a lot of screenings available early in the week. Great. Yeah. Now, let's talk about the food camp. Yeah. This is really a neat idea. It is. And, you know, it, it's. I hesitate to even say it's a trend because I think it's really a change in lifestyle for mm -hmm. a lot of people to produce their own food. And, I mean, not just cooking, but, you know, gardening, beekeeping. You know, we've seen people start to raise chickens in their backyard. Yeah, that's very popular. You know, fermenting, pickling. I mean, really... Things that used to be sort of, you know, commonplace back in pioneer times are starting to come back now. And uh, that's what Madison Food Camp is all about. It goes on at the Goodman Community Center today, 9 a.m. this morning till 4.30 this afternoon. Demonstrations all day. $15 donation gets you in the door. And to learn more, go to madisonfoodcamp.org. Excellent. Yeah. And now uh, some more entertainment. Absolutely, right. yes. And, uh, you know, on the, in this film vein, we love Madison's Duck Soup Cinema. Mm -hmm. This goes on a few times during the winter and the spring over there at the Overture Center in, in the Capitol Theater, which is sort of the old, you know, Oscar Mayer Theater over there. Um, they present a silent film along with vaudeville-style entertainment. So there's singing, dancing, maybe some juggling and, and magic. And uh, that goes on before to Today, it's 2 p.m. and 7 p.m., they'll screen uh, Girl Shy, starring Harold Lloyd. You saw some pictures there of him. He's, he was sort of known for these tortoiseshell glasses. And it is a riot every single time. You know, it's it's a silent movie. They accompany it live on the big yeah, so Grand Barton organ. Yeah, the entertainment is live. Absolutely. Yeah. And, um, you know, kids love it. And it's, it's really, I think, a great way to sort of unplug them from whatever video console they're sitting in, sitting in front of. And, you know, it really shows. That, I mean, this film's from 1924. It endures. It's almost 100 years old. And, it. I mean, people will be, you know, laughing out loud at this thing this afternoon. And now we have some musical entertainment, too. Yes, right, right. The Hussy. Now, Madison puts out a lot of great rock music. The Hussy is maybe one of the more courageous and interesting acts that we've put out in quite a while. Bobby and Heather, two-person group. He plays guitar, she plays drums. Typically, they play in small clubs, like the Frequency or, or Mickey's Tavern. They have a new LP coming out, so they'll be at the, in the big room at the High Noon Saloon tonight, starting at 10. Seven bucks gets in the door. It's 18 and up. They're joined by, like, four or five other bands. These are sort of noisy, garage rock, punk rock bands from around Wisconsin and Illinois. So, you know, wear your earplugs. All right, be ready for but, it. But, uh, yeah, the Hussies, great. They're totally unique. You'll never see anything like them again. Okay. And real quick, yes. big name coming. Willie Madison. Nelson, right. We got to remind people that Willie Nelson's going to be here tomorrow. Uh, this is Sunday night at Overture Hall, 730. And uh, who doesn't love Willie Nelson? I mean, he, speaking of being sort of a, you know, an outlaw, you know, a renegade, he keeps on keeping on. It's a so classic. I, I love Willie. Thanks so much, Jason. Yeah, thank Lots you. Lots of great ideas. People can't complain that there's never anything to never. do here. Never, right. That's for certain.